Scott Prince says he'll end his career on the Gold Coast after signing a new long-term deal. The 29-year-old halfback re-signed with the club until the end of 2014 today in a deal worth around $2 million. Scott Prince admits the lifestyle factor was a major reason why he and his family came to the Gold Coast and it's why he'll become a titan for life after re-signing for another five years. I'm very happy to sign here and the prospect of uh, retiring on the Gold Coast is certainly uh, exciting. Uh, I know the family love living here, but uh, first and foremost, you know, I'm, I'm pretty happy with, with the coaching staff and the players that we've got at the club and you know, love playing alongside them. The Queensland Origin star had already committed to the club until the end of next season, but both parties opted to get a deal done and dusted before any speculation about his future started to arise. And with this uh, you know the, the signing of a new contract and um, you know ruling out the you know the uh, the opportunities to go elsewhere you know it makes me feel settled. And Princey was very open. He said, um, "I'm not going anywhere. I've got no intentions of leaving the joint. So let's just get this thing knocked over." So it was it was it was very refreshing. It was great. Um, and it's a credit, I suppose, to, to his maturity. Prince has represented Australia and Queensland and won a premiership with the West Tigers. His next goal is to co-captain the Titans to an inaugural finals appearance but any talk they can win the Premiership is quickly dismissed. It's scary to talk about it at the moment. Um, you know, there's 16 teams in the competition and uh, every one of them can win it, so you know, we'll just mix it with them. And Prince also believes the Titans' wins over the Storm and the Bulldogs while he was out injured has finally buried the theory they can't win without him. I think that's uh, a, a pretty you know, stupid statement, you know, the team can't win without me. Um, I, I believe in the guys and I think over the last three to four weeks that the guys believe in themselves now. So i just got to come in and pull my weight to, uh, to keep my position. Up the road in Brisbane there were fears the Broncos would have to take on the Panthers without Justin Hodges after he walked off training early with what appeared to be a quad strain. No, I'm alright mate, just having a bit of a uh, deload week, um, yeah, just trying to look after the legs and the arms, so yeah, just having a bit of a weight session now. After a disrupted start to the season for personal reasons, injury and suspension, Hodges believes he's starting to find some form and he wants his Australian jersey back. Yeah, I'm getting there, slowly, um, yeah, just trying to get some more, you know, some more game time, it's only my third game this year, I haven't really had any uh, trial matches to go off, so uh, it's just one of those things that's going to take a little bit of time, but I'm hoping over the next few weeks so I should be fine. Sean Lawson, Fox Sports News. Fox Sports News on Channel 513. It's on all the time.